Hello, I'm Tony Trungo and Superintendent Millville Public Schools here to provide you with another update. Uh, today's March 26th. And what I wanted to do is bring some clarity to my previous presentation. There were some questions about the, that last part on the far right. It says all students four full days a week. And that's incorrect because that would include virtual students and virtual students can remain virtual to the remainder part of the year. And so the, the correct phrase would be the current hybrid students would go all all hybrid students can go back to school in person four days a week. And now for some key dates on March 29th, that's the deadline if you wish to make a change in your learning platform. Uh, and we have a change of learning option form. It's on the it's on your schools at website and make sure you get that to your principal by March 29th. So we can make that change for the fourth marking period. And then on April 12th, we come back from spring break and we'll return to this current situation we're in today, or even when we leave before spring break, uh, because the change will take place the week after we come back from uh, spring break, April 19th, we'll, where we're gonna combine grades K to eight, where all hybrid students in K to eight will come in four, four days a week, because uh, we already have preschool, special ed and high school coming in four days a week now. And then we would include on April 19th, grades K to eight, and we're working uh, on that right now. And again, I wanna say it again, if you're virtual on April 1st, you can be virtual on April 19th. Uh, it's, it, it's your prerogative to the remainder part of the year, uh, but you do not have to hand in any paperwork. If you're already virtual, there's, you don't need to do anything. And just for a visual, this is spring break. And this little icon with the orange and blue means four days a week. So you can see that the high school, the special ed and the preschool are, 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 are four days a week. We combine the orange and blue hybrid cohorts. Uh, but K to eight, when you come back on April 12th, the orange cohort will come in on Monday and Tuesday, April 12th and 13th. So I wanted to make sure that we are aware of that. And if you're virtual, again, stay virtual. And then on Wednesday, it'll be an all, all, all student remote day. And then on the 15th and 16th, the high school special ed and pre-K, those groups will come in for the four days. But for K to eight, just the blue cohort of hybrid kids will come in for in-person learning. And then obviously virtual stays virtual. And then the following week is where we have that change where we have all grades of hybrid will be coming in four days a week. So if you're hybrid, you're coming in for in-person learning Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, starting April 19th. So you're coming in four days a week as opposed to two days a week. And we're looking forward to that. We're planning and we're trying to make it the safest and healthiest environment for our, our students and our staff. Uh, that being said, I uh, wanna wish everyone a happy weekend and, and look forward to seeing you on Monday. And if you have any questions, please feel free, feel free to reach out. Thanks.